Good day all. So last time we made 483 wheel horsepower hitting some HPFP limitations. Now we're back with upgraded high pressure fuel pump and some additional contingencies. Hope you all enjoy.
so it upgraded high pressure fuel pump e40 mix met big boost turbo built motor the car made 499 wheel horsepower 504 wheel foot pounds of torque now it's time for our contingency plan um, cheat mode enabled So a dry shot of nitrous made 544 wheel horsepower and 555 wheel foot pounds of torque with a 50 horsepower shot. Once again, we will hit in the fuel limitations, even with switching to the GPH MET nozzle. Um, from discussion with snow performance, there's not much more we can do for MET unless we go with two methanol pumps or the new upgraded high pressure tank basically this 544 wheel horsepower was basically we broke the record here um, but we won't finish still had some more left in the tank about a month later we went back on the dyno with a wet shot of nitrous we had a couple concerns using the stock low pressure fuel pump for the wet shot and upon testing we had no issues even with a 125 horsepower shot the 50 horsepower shot made 561 wheel horsepower 543 wheel foot pounds of torque the 75 horsepower shot made 577 wheel horsepower 566 wheel foot pounds of torque we then went to 100 horsepower shot and shortly after we noticed that we ran out of nitrous and did not get to fine tune this map. The 100 horsepower shot made 593 wheel horsepower, 576 wheel foot pounds of torque, running a bit low on nitrous. Yeah, you can see a graph of the nitrous pressure going below the set point, and the controller cuts the nitrous actually during the dyno run. Currently the car is on a 125 horsepower shot of nitrous and should be over 600 horsepower. Unfortunately, I didn't get time to finalize the tune or redyno. Here's a graph of stock 265 wheel horsepower, big boost turbo, E40 water methanol injection, 499 wheel horsepower. Then we added a 50 horsepower shot on top of that which made 561 wheel horsepower. Then we added a 75 shot, which made 577 wheel horsepower. And then with the 100 horsepower shot, the car made 592 wheel horsepower. Thank you all for watching and stay tuned. I'll be releasing all the details on the upgrades and modifications soon. All right, special thanks to all who made this possible. Special shout out to FAT Paul. This wouldn't be possible without his excellent tuning skills. Protein and freaks um, would not be possible without this tuning platform. Really appreciate the support from Harlem Surge Design. Um, shout out to Big Boost for his turbo kit, which really pushed this engine. Um, engine was built by us. Um, absolutely no issues with the engine build no oil consumption no issues at all the car as you can see pushes the power and holds up pretty good xhp flash tool the car has a stage 3 transmission flash basically the best days out for bmws um cp carillo piston rods um super tech valve spring retainers arp head studs and main studs purchase from real street performance acl race rod bearings the car has a snow performance stage 2.5 kit vp racing fuels um, bms um, boost adapter and also thanks to the guys at bms for the support with the blower valve to a smart blower valve a special thanks to nitrous express dyno lab best dyno it is in trinidad shout out to those guys um Shiv did the exhaust and the tips as you can see one of the best titanium tips from pipeworks thanks to everyone else who made this possible